My normal design process starts with taking fabric onto a mannequin. I'm always looking at how I can capture fluidity and motion still and have movement in that relationship to the body. The Met Gala is special for designers because it's really the biggest fashion event in the world. For this year's Met Gala, we're working with GE Additive and Proto Labs to create a collection. And we're actually printing an entire dress that would be unachievable with fabric. Our GE Additive team was able to guide Zach through how to design for additive manufacturing. In order to print a piece, you have to design the entire gown in 3D space. Zach wanted to come in and push us to go a little bit farther to do some very unique geometries and shapes. And additive manufacturing allows you to capture that complexity in a way that other manufacturing technologies do not. The great thing that our AdWorks team brings to the table is that we have a broad depth of experience across the whole additive manufacturing industry. We reached out to Proto Labs, who's one of our premier partners, and thought they would be a great fit for this project. Zach's not limited by traditional manufacturing processes of can a part be cut to shape, can it suspend itself under its own weight. He has complete freedom in his design. This year, the Met Gala's theme is camp. Not in summer camp, but in the idea of campy as kind of elevated, exaggerated, almost supernatural. I really started looking at the natural form of a flower. How could we find a rose form for a human body and kind of morph the engineering of actual petals and how they would build onto a dress? The real benefits of additive manufacturing are that you can crank up the complexity of the parts. This can be done in industries like aerospace where they're reducing the weight to make the airplanes more efficient. Our AdWorks team focuses on collaborating with our customers to help bring their additive vision to reality. Working with Proto Labs, we were able to leverage their expertise with manufacturing and finishing polymer into making this project successful. This year, the rose dress is going to be worn by Jordan Dunn. Jordan Dunn is incredibly stunning, inside and out. For me, science, engineering, and art all work together, and that's why standing at the forefront of using 3D printing is so important and special for me.